Hello, it's Andrew here at Cornwall Land Rover. In the for you today we have a Land Rover Defender 90 TD5, uh, registered on 26th of September 2001. Let's go around the vehicle for you now. We've got a few rusty patches on that front bumper, which you can hopefully see, and paint on the uh, front grille and Headlamp surrounds her has faded, as you can hopefully see. A few scratches on the near side quarter panel there, and on the bonnet, if you have a few scratches as well, and a couple of chips. Front offside panel, a few light scratches, and a few uh, deeper, deeper ones. Not the rest of the panel. Just, again, just a couple of light scratches along the panel, and just down below there, you can see the paint faded and uh, a little bit of it has come off as well. Wheel arch looks to be in good condition, just a small chip there needs touching up. Just, just there, as you can see. Turn the time, we're looking at around three and a half mil, and see the white steel alloy there. Surrounding the alloy, that uh, steel wheel, should I say? Got step to uh, ease access into the vehicle. Front mud flap there. Driver's door, a couple of things which you can hopefully see on the video. In there, and a few scratches as well to go along. Little buzzy patches. To do with touching up. Uh, rear offside panel. Some ding down below there, as you can see. Uh, a few small light scratches here and there. Scratches along the big panel. A few light ones which should polish off. Just to the rear of the panel, you can see a few bloody patches on the side here. Just touch it in there. Wheel arch, a couple of light scratches here and there. And trend the time looking around two and a half mil. Steel alloy. Steel wheel even, sorry. Um, a few uh, rusty patches there as you can see. Go inside the vehicle for you. Tear there on the prime seat. Sunroof above. There's a chip there on the windscreen which you can hopefully see. Hop in. Oh. Cubby box, tape player. Vehicle comes with only one key and no fob, as you can see. And the problem without with it being without a fob, sometimes you have to turn the key over a couple of times. Because of the, uh, because of the alarm. You can hear the radios working and the fan. Just show you the wipers. MOT until the 14th of September 2015. Hopefully, it comes up clear air on the uh, video and the vehicles had two owners from new carpet lights as well both sides oh. moving on now to the rear so you've got rear mud flaps and a tow bar and I think you can clearly see far away that 
far distance. There are a few, quite a bit of patches where it's lacking a bit of paint. Still in the door, underneath the tail lights. A few scratches go along as well. Quite a few, which you can hopefully see. I'm trying to point, point out as much as I can here. So you got a, a rubber protection protection mat and a spare steel wheel there. See there are a few quite a few scratches on the panel in the back. The alpine lights, you can see. the near side put a paint needed down below there as you can see a few scratches as well wheel arch the scuff and you could do with a bit of paint a scratch along the wheel arch there as well Just down below trend the tire we're looking at around four and a half mil again you can see rust patches on the uh, steel wheel the panel itself has quite a scratch going along as you can see there and a few more scratches go along with it. Uh, the half the panel, you can see scratches along the panel. Scratches there. Passenger door. A uh, few scratches here and there, as you can see. Once again. One or two small dings as well. There we go. A few more marks to go along. Did have trouble opening the passenger door earlier with the key. Still not able to seem to want to bud. Um, down below, pat, patch of paint missing. Uh, a couple more need touching up. Uh, a few scratches, a couple light dings there as well. On the front near side panel. A couple more light scratches here and there as you can see. Wheel arch, a couple of touch ups needed. Trend the tyre, looking at around 3.5-4 mil. Steel alloy against again steel wheel sorry a few rusty patches along around and that's it. I hope you enjoy this video. Thank you very much. <laughs>